Yay, Castlevania. Symphony of the Night. It's a higher level one, that one, yeah. Sweat or something on my control. Okay. I hate it when my controllers get sweaty. And it's like, okay, I guess I can't like use my controller. Uh, shit. Where do I go? I think up. Well, I can't. I think I have to double jump. Oh, I'll, I'll, try. Uh, I'll try. I will try Death's uh, orders. The clock tower. Yes, good point and click adventure game. It's actually really interesting. I like it. I haven't played it, I've just seen playthroughs. It's like different ending concept. Something they experimented with here, but like in a non subtle way, in a subtle way, in a dialogue. Like actual. Like, like, I mean, you can show them, obviously, for a man. Soma's bad man. He's, he's, he's a bad boy. Thank you. Xbox controller died, I'll be right back with batteries. So, controller died, whatever. Whew. Like, I stopped moving, I'm like, what the hell? <laughs> What'd I do wrong? No. Any secrets in here? I can't remember. I, I played this game a year ago. I played it, like, once a year for, like, this is my third year. <laughs> Castlevania. Die, you weird Egyptian monster. Wait, I gotta use the D-pad. I always default to thumbstick. Because the D-pad is hard. Cool. That'll heal me for like 6 health. It's like New York pizza. It's like an 18 inch New York pizza pepperoni. Heals for like 20 HP. Like, come on. It's like 
IGA never had a freaking pizza in his life. At least not a New York style. Yeah, get wrecked Stone Rose, which actually gets called something else later in the series. Because name identities like um, Gremlin and Ukobok. <laughs> oh, the fog didn't decide to load. Rip. I'm so disappointed. Yes, here we go. Okay, so with this, you have to like jump, otherwise you can yes, Barry. Thank you, Kanye, Barry. The music here is good though. Castlevania has always had a great soundtrack, but like, so does it really great. Yeah, I can't make that, I need a double. They got, do I have to go up to the church? I can't remember. I think I might. Because I can't do anything here. Yeah, I need a double jump, so it's probably a warper right very right, fast. Um, yeah, I'm gonna have to just go up through the library and go to the lab. That's fine. Whatever. Or not library, alchemy lab. Based on luck, I, I feel like they are. I get a lot of them because you know I have 119 luck. <laughs> 99 plus 20. Yes. I love like when you like bring up a save file and you see like a high stat like 99. Or, like Castlevania: Dawn of Sorrow was like from what I've seen infamous with the cheat codes and the way that like the health worked. Like it was so easy to tell if it was hacked because it was just 9,999. So it's like. I wonder if that's legitimate or not. Like, whoa, shit, you, that, that's hacked? Whoa, no way. Who would have thought? Oh, no, please. I prefer the Bible or the, you know, the world, but this works too. Working music with, like, drums and stuff makes it sound like people are, like, entering through the garage. No, it's just the like, Castlevania music is like intense as all shit. Ba ba ba! Like totally shit. Okay, but it's okay. That's what Castlevania is intense. It's not a pussy's game, even though. Well, everybody like says it's hard. It's kind of easy for me at least. That's what happens when you're good. I love the like. 
how clear this is. The PS1, you could see, like, the pixels on it and how, like, you know, you could see how, like, PS1 era was with all these cool textures and shit. It, like, looks awesome. So, think about this emulator, I haven't tried it. It was, like, freezing when it, or, like, being really slow when I, uh, configured, not configured. Oh, uh, yeah, I was configuring the graphics plugin. So, I'll do a test eventually, see how well it will like, run max out resolution. But that's also part of the reason why I was having issues. So, we meet again, Alucard. It seems so. As friendly as ever, I see. It's strange. This castle is different than I remember it. This castle is a creature of chaos. It may take many incarnations. So I can't trust my memories, huh? Oh well, I'll do my best. Good luck. There we go. In the church. Or chapel. What? Fucking. Sanctuary. There we go. There's a real term. Up. They're called Hill Guards in Portrait of Ruin. Another identity crisis. Yeah, this super powerful puppet sword that's got like eight other swords around it dies in two hits because I'm using one of the end game items. Obviously, it takes a like, good GPU to like run this shit, but at the same time, it's all like processor. Like I couldn't do this with my old FX8150 AMD processor. It's all just that. That's a fun video game. What a what a blast, dude! I swear to God, the fucking bird is there. Again. Okay, well I still beat the bird, so that's fine. I I love your son of a bitch. Okay, that's fair. Are you kidding me? I'm gonna have a stroke. This is like, the game's like, yeah, you want to go through it. No, you don't. Okay. Jump low. Frag the bird when it comes after you. I'm going to, like, jump. You're... S Jesus Christ. I'm going to die. Okay. Everything does one damage, but since that knockback exists, you can't get any more. That's, like, so gay. He's, like, the son of Dracula, and, like, some crows can bully him. Did that crow not die? I swear to God, that crow didn't die. I'm gonna... Okay. That one, especially. That's like 138. There's no way a flimsy-ass little crow can, like, take a beat like that. Oh, a blue raven. Wow. I wonder if they just palette swap the crow. <laughs> it's a completely different enemy. Do you see? It's completely different. It has a separate color. It's the exact same size sprite and everything. It's just a different color. I'm not taking your dumb power. I'm not doing that. The Bible in here is like, I'm gonna protect you. 
I may not do a ton of damage, but I'm gonna, like, work, you know? And in, like, every other game ever, it just spins around of its own accord. Like, this is, like, like, it just spins in circles and is useless. Here, it's like, oh, okay. This is going to, like, hit stuff and you may or may not kill. Otherwise, it's like, I gotta, like, RNG set this thing up to use it. Okay, boss fight. Okay, I'm just gonna kill this hippogriff in like two seconds. Or maybe more. Die, you evil bird. Uh, die, Harry Potter's best friend. Holy shit, that thing has a lot of HP. That has a lot of HP. That that actually that's gotta have like 600 HP. Oh. Sorry again. Impressive. You're very strong. What is it you want? You didn't come here to tell me that. You're right. Do you know the name Richter Belmont? Richter? Of the Belmont clan? Of course, but... He disappeared about a year ago. <laughs> oh, Cassie And I'm agreed. sure he's here. If you see him, please let me know. As you wish, my lady. Ooh. Thank you. So, you do know how to be a gentleman. Alucard's an incel. R slash incel. <laughs> you said my lady. Go m'lady and tip his fucking fedora. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I love, like, one-shotting everything except bosses. Even then bosses, they, they don't do anything. So it's basically just how quickly can I kill these guys before they die. I think the PlayStation, no, Dreamcast probably came out before it, but PlayStation was the first mainstream, like, like, PlayStation, like, that was one of, like, the name companies, like, Nintendo was, you know, like, that. And, like, PlayStation was the first, and Sony, rather, first, like, really CD people, and so they were like, okay, you know, we'll use CDs, which, yeah, they have boot times, but you can do way more shit with them. And so, like, people took advantage of this, and, like, that's why Soten is so good. It's like, I mean, I'm sure I'd be fine if it was on, like, an N64 cartridge, and they basically just, uh... Oh, cool warp. Uh, they, well, if they, like, you know, made it, like, okay, um, we're just gonna use superior processing power to make, like, you know how, like, King of Fighters on the PS2, it's a sprite-based game, but they were able to basically just run it awesome, because they were just... They could just, um, they said superior hardware running easy, like, you know, to run stuff. So, it was like, okay, this isn't going to be an issue at all. So, they just did that, and that's why, it, like, not that's why, but they're, they're just doing that here, basically. And, you know, 3D games are in well, but. They were like, okay, we have all this stuff. We made, like, a five-hour game. I mean, I've beaten this in, like, five and a half hours. This run will probably be, like, more like six, probably, but, you know. Okay, I got the leap stone, so I can go into that part of the castle. 
Actually, what am I doing on four cards? But, yeah, so, like, they were like, okay, we'll just take advantage of this, and, like, we can add these cool, minuscule details, like, the fairy, if she's, like, if Alucard falls asleep in a chair, she'll sink, and then if he gets up, she'll be, like, like, you know, shocked, like, right out of stardom or something, and, or, like, Alucard and the bat, the bat likes him, then we turn into a person, and the bat's, like, WTF, like... <laughs> <laughs> the only thing this game doesn't have is an easy warp. It's like, you just have to, like, you can't choose. Don, I'm sorry to that. It's like, I want to warp to this location, I'll choose it, you know. That's the only play I have with this game. It is per pretty much perfect otherwise, like, you know. And also, it utilizes the Metroidvania. Um, I just like the Metroidvania from Castlevania. I guess maybe because I grew up with it, but it's like, you know. I can just level up and get stronger and like it, it's just a blast, you know. Oh, yeah, I'll save, why not? Cool beans, alright. Yeah, this is it, it's just a good game. <laughs> And also, you know, they get to take advantage of other stuff. It's like, oh, okay, we have hardware, let's use it. And, like, the only area where it lags is the waterfall area. And that's only on the PS1, because the PS1, like, it wasn't just, like, it was no supercomputer. It just did what it could, and then that part was kind of like, oh, fuck, when it had to run the waterfall. And so it was like, oh, shit, I still fell. I'm such a bad player. Oh, I can dive kick now. Let's go. That's like, I'm used to doing that because I play Harmony of Despair, and that's the only way to get around the issue. You... Yeah, no, this is like the only way to get around effectively. So it's like, okay, I'm stuck doing this. And then here, um, let, let me make it. Okay, I made it. That's cool. Oh, I'm so close. Are you kidding me? Okay, so... Ugh. Make it... Oh, you're kidding me. Okay, I was gonna say, like... Come on. Down the clock tower. This place is... Oh my god, the water looks so good in an emulator with filters? That, look, that looks so good. Holy shit. And you got, like, all the gears in the back, and, like, obviously they've got less frames because of the way the PS1 can handle all of that shit at, like, native frame rate with, like, Alucard as well. It's just looking more... Oh, I'm so close. I'll, it's possible to get up there, but I don't really care just because like, I have way better shit. So it's no loss. Yeah, you think his stats are crazy now? You get like up to a thousand HP, over a thousand actually. I've never gotten to 99. So it was like max stats, but no really good. Of course, you got the clock tower section, which probably, I don't even remember the name of it. Uh, it's like, clock tower, oh, spoilers, uh, skip 20 seconds ahead of here. Now, okay, in the reverse castle. But, you know, if you if you don't know, I mean, if you, if you either get offended by spoilers, or you're so by now, bummer. I remember everything about this game, but like... I might get 190, we'll see what happens. If I like beat this quickly, like, below five and a half hours, I'll probably just like... If I have like everything but Dracula done by five and a half hours, then I'll just actually like, get the best... I've never gotten the best ending before, I've only gotten... Uh, shit, what is it? Um... I haven't gotten 196 uh, plus percentage ending. I've gotten the one before that, though. I've actually gotten the bad ending before. Like, kill Richter. And that, you know. But you obviously don't want to do that, so. What's back here? Ooh. Oh, it's just a. Uh, huh. Like how he jumps over me, and it's like, ah, bye. No, 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 no. Please, please, please. I really want to. Bible, Bible, no! Oh, great, I'm stuck with this. Oh, 
fucking annoying. Oh my god, that's cancer. I'm gonna find another sub weapon here eventually. Holy water is kinda useless, to be honest. Oh, is this the one where you... Yes! It's a, it's a vandal sword. Very cool. And he's... Yep, there we go. My sword's better. Suck it. Oh, man. Sorry. Level 18 already? Holy crap, that's good. I got a holy sword. That thing is probably useless. Uh, yeah. Oh, who do we fight up here? We fight not Darkling Bad. We fight. We fight Al. Oh shit, Malphus. But Malphus is actually Karasum. That's the name, Karasum, and it's. Karasuman's Christian, um, yeah, Christian, uh, Christianity. Yeah, well now he's not anymore, but it's funny too, because Karasuman becomes like, I love when they make like, basically early on bosses, like actual just enemies you'll encounter, flat up, like later in the game, like in reverse castle, you see like, I think it's in Orox's quarters, but the reverse. Um, in the garden area, there's like, there like two or three of them in there. He cross them and just kind of exists. He's not the best. At, I like him, he's pretty cool. He's not the best at the game. Ooh, a scimitar. Or, or a falchion. Okay, that works too. <laughs> I really thought it'd be a scimitar, but no, it's a falchion. So we need the bad ability to get up here because it's like funny because he technically you could unlock the castle, like reverse castle if you have the holy glasses right now, but you can't. Uh, plus I want to get the high jump boots, so those things are cool. Oh, it's the holy water? Okay. But basically that happens. How convenient! We can't get up there. I wonder if it was programmed that way. So, we have to go down. Now they got the double jump, we can go get to the succubus boss, so I'm gonna go, uh, warp down there, actually, now. Because, yeah. Is, do I have a warp? I have a warp to... Whatever, close enough. Um... Dankula's castle. Okay, there we go.
suck. Not a save point that I gotta go for. Actually, I'll go fight this horse. Yep, this is the way. Cool. Now I can go and fight a boss and level up. It's a free level, basically. Level my 19. Mm, 20. Okay, close enough. Cool. Yeah, the only bad thing about this game is that was the loading times, but that's to be expected on a freaking PS1 game. I mean, you're not gonna. <laughs> It's a CD in like 1997. It's not gonna like work fast. Okay, so for this, I have to like. Oh, you're fucking kidding me. Do we? Do you have to have the bat? Are you kidding me? I don't remember where you get the bat. It's like shit. I so I still can't get to her, so I'm gonna just have to... Okay, alright. Alright, I'm just gonna go and pause. I'm gonna, like, stop the recording here, and then I'll just, like, start after I'm done. I just have to go do something, so be right back.